brand new details this afternoon about a jump and run in Raleigh. This was breaking news first at 4.30 this morning. We were the only ones on scene moments after it happened on I-440 near Western Boulevard. Now, in the past 90 minutes, Ed Crump tweeted, this woman arrested for DWI is also accused of slipping out of handcuffs, assaulting a state trooper, and then trying to jump from her car, from his car, I should say. The woman was then taken to the Wake County Detention Center, and that's where Ed joins us live. Ed, uh, is she still in jail? No, John, she posted this bond just a short time ago and then walked out of the front doors here at the Wake County Detention Center just south of downtown Raleigh. Now, 26 year old Madison Garver was with two friends and called a cab to take her home. She's sporting a shiner on her left eye. She told us she was assaulted by a state trooper who pulled her over last night on Western Boulevard at the Beltline. After two, but after she had her mugshot taken and she was booked, she was charged by that trooper with assaulting him, driving drunk, having an open container of alcohol in her car and speeding. According to court documents, the trooper told a magistrate that she actually assaulted him twice, slipped out of handcuffs and attempted to jump from his cruiser at 45 miles per hour. Garver says she did jump out of the cruiser and skinned her knees in the process. I was like, I, I don't deserve to go to jail. You didn't give me um, any answers as to why I was being arrested. You know, da, 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 no communication, but basically. And um, I, I turned around, you know, to start walking towards the car and he said, hey, and he had a flashlight in his hand and he just punched me right in the face. And the last thing I know is I'm down on the ground. Now, it should be noted that this is not the first time Garver has been charged with DWI and accused of assaulting an officer. The last time around, it was a sheriff's deputy. She says he tased her. It turns out that sheriff's deputies' cases, more than 100 cases, including Garver's case, were dropped after he was accused of lying in court. John, we've reached out to the Highway Patrol about all of this, but have not heard back from them yet. All right, Ed, I know you'll stay on it. Thank you very much. Happening now, there's...